Well, just got everything packed up behind me. Taking off to the airport this morning with dad. Got a trip I've been looking forward to for a long time. We are heading to go hunt Croatia. That is right. We are heading to go hunt in Croatia. We're gonna start this trip off by hunting Central Croatia for red stag and wild boar. It's kind of a hidden gem hunting in Croatia. I've been looking forward to it for a long time. Then we're gonna go hunt the coastal area and I'm pretty pumped because I've got one of the limited Kri Kri Ibex tags there and this is a spot to where you can actually film them. So man, ready for this trip. Also a couple other species to hunt along the coast. Her Croatia is awesome. Can't wait to experience it for myself. morning and driven into the area that we're gonna hunt first we're gonna hunt stags and wild boar here and it's crazy driving over here it actually looks a lot like where I live in Michigan and to find out we're actually on the same parallel if you take it across the ocean this is basically the same parallel that Michigan's on pretty cool so seeing a lot of the same things this area that we're hunting is on the far east side of Croatia right on the Serbian border and this area is known for big stags probably the best area in all of Croatia it's also the largest national park in Croatia so been looking forward to this one but it all starts here looking for big stags thicker in here than what I thought it would be just driving in. There's some fields on the edge, but we're gonna still hunt through this. As you can see, the guys behind are just layering on the bug spray because the mosquitoes are thick in here. I just had a couple massive rains a couple weeks ago that really flooded this area, which made it perfect for mosquitoes. So you're probably gonna see a lot of this going on for me, but you can see why they grow big stags here.
just sneaking into the elevated stand right now. I'm hoping the audio picks this up, but there's dags that are roaring all around us. We've had some fighting down over here, too. We've got about 30 minutes to look at light. We just want to get in here and let everything settle. We're overlooking a big grass field. The temperature dropped about 20 degrees last night, and it's got everything wired up like crazy. Thank you. Thank you. Do you want my sausage to us? Boy. Boy, it's the only idea that I know what to believe. Holy smokes. We got out of the high stand and hit it and spotted stock on this guy. And Marco called him into, I kid you not, 12 yards. He just kept coming. Looks like a giant. Literally fell right over there. That was empty. Hence, he roared right when he hit the opening and came so close, like, right in my sweet spot to about 12 yards. In this, in this bush, is, it's, it's not easy, but if you know how to make a sound, yeah, yeah. call them a little bit, it works, you know. Mm. Like what I make a sound, this is a, a young one, like a, a young, young uh, stag, mm -hmm. you know, the cow, you know, little one. And uh, they think, if the little one is somewhere and calling the mother, they think the mother is in heat and they will come, you know. Uh, That's the one you can see, it's coming directly, you know. Yeah, and you just but can't. you need to be in the range and I need to hear by the voice of the snack, does he have a females or not? Mm -hmm. If he is with the big herds of the females, he will not leave the females and come to me, then okay. I need to do something different. <clears throat> but that was 
That was awesome. Yeah. Yeah. That was awesome. Red Stag in Croatia. You can't beat that. Yeah. With a good wind. Yeah. It's really good. giant free-range stag here in Croatia and I mean he came in close Marco hit the call which he was doing all from his mouth by the way which is very impressive and this guy came screaming in because he thought a young one was challenging him and that was probably one of the most adrenaline packed couple of minutes that I've had he came in and was just roaring his head off right in front of us came I kid you not 12 yards and just an amazing free range stag here in Croatia. Can't beat that. Awesome morning, fog coming up, pheasants ripping all over the place and you can tell we're just surrounded by stags everywhere. So the last bite symbolizes respect for the animal, right? Yeah. Yep. yep. Like a really important tradition in uh, Croatia about tradition of hunting mm -hmm. that we give like uh, the last meal in the mouth yep. and that little branch what you have on the head, it, uh, we put the branch in the wound a little bit and then put it on your head gotcha. and we just keep the honor to the animal because animal give you hunting pleasure mm -hmm. yeah i will congratulation one more time thank you really nice thank you so are we going somewhere they've got boars or stags? In the same area as everything. Okay. So I hope that we will see also nice boar and stags, but you never know.
somewhere on the right. Ow. Oh. My second bullet. So that was a good one? Yeah, yeah. Good one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. What were you, when you came in, like, what, what were you looking for? Teeth? Yes, I see teeth. Teeth? teeth? Yes, yes. Yeah. First, mm -hmm. you need to see the body to see that it's mature. Yes. Uh -huh. And then I was looking when he was coming, I saw the teeth cells come uh, yes. down. Okay. Because yeah. I could tell as soon as you guys saw him off in the distance, you could tell mm -hmm. it was a big, a yeah, big yeah, one, right? Yes, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. Oh, that's awesome. We were sitting here and there were a lot of wild boars coming out, a couple of younger males. And then the guys saw this one coming a long ways and could instantly tell it was a larger boar. And I had to wait for it to clear. Um, hit it in the shoulder. I think the second one I hit it right in the neck. I think it's laying right in the grass right there. We're going to give it a minute and go take a look. Good one? Good one. Yeah. Oh, it's oh, a yes. lot bigger than I thought it was. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Awesome. Yeah. So when you're when you were looking at them to tell, it was when you saw this right here? Yeah. How much you took that, out? That's what you touched right now, the lip. Yep. Yes. You can see it's very wide open, the lips, when he's coming to you, you know. Uh -huh. Make a picture of the thing. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yeah. Well, we were waiting for a big guy just like this to come out, and just a perfect, perfect wild boar here in Croatia. Doesn't get much better than this. I will say, as you can tell, flying around here, there are a few mosquitoes. It's very wet and that's exactly what the wild boar like. How old do you think this one is, Marco? About well, seven. Seven. Well, seven. Seven. It's a great free range wild boar in Croatia. Mm -hmm.